Thank you guys all for coming out today. We're really excited to be a part of the Lynchburg community. Um, I'm Josh Cromwell, uh, finance manager here at Star Hill. We got Robbie O'Kane, who's our brewmaster, uh, and of course, Mayor Tweedy joining us. Um, so we'll keep this short, um, but thanks for everybody for joining us. We're really excited. Uh, Lynchburg's a great city, and we're really happy to be a part of it. Everybody that we've dealt with so far has been um, really encouraging and uh, great partners thus far getting us to where we are. So. Um, we're excited about the building. Uh, Dan and Dave, who own the building, have been great uh, landlords thus far in our short time together. But as you can see, we've got some renderings up here. Um, we can talk later and give you some more detail, but um, we're, we're really excited to get in here and start to do some work and hopefully open up as early as we can in early 2020. So um, I will turn the podium over to Mayor Tweedy, but uh, thank you for having us today. Thank you. I am just so happy, the enthusiasm that's in this room for this brewery and what's happening. I want to first recognize um, many people in the room, but my council members, uh, Vice Mayor Dolan is here, Council Member Wright, Council Member Pero, Council Member Wilder, Council Member Nelson, uh, Representative Council Member of Congressman Klein's office here, Aaron Van Allen, our fire chief is here. Uh, there, other city staff, I'm not missing anybody, hopefully our foundation, Lynchburg City Schools Foundation Director is here, and so many others um, with our regional chamber staff and our economic development staff. So we are happy to be here today to welcome Star Hill to the Hill City. So let's give them a crap. Star Hill on Main will invite even more people to visit and enjoy downtown Lynchburg and will benefit the entire Lynchburg community by serving as yet another important attraction, driving visitors and reinvesting in the community. We applaud Star Hill's track record of working with the local nonprofit community through their Cheers for Charity program and know they will continue to make an impact in their new Lynchburg location. Thank you for your investment, both of you, and to now have an official brewmaster in the city is exciting. I know that the city's economic development and tourism staff and the Downtown Lynchburg Association, Ashley and her team, have been working hand in hand with Star Hill to make this investment a reality in the Hill City. We are excited to welcome you as a new corporate citizen in the city of Lynchburg, and welcome to Downtown Lynchburg. Thank you so much. Thanks. Um, so basically, if you guys can't tell, we're pretty excited to be down here. So for the next uh, little while, we are available. Anyone in this Star Hill shirt, uh, we want to talk about the space. We want to talk about being in Lynchburg. We're very excited to be here. So fire away. We'll be around. After that, this afternoon at 530 at the Glass House, we hope you can all join us um, for some beers and then a show afterwards. So we're super excited. Thanks for being here. We appreciate it. And uh, we're looking forward to getting started. Uh, we're really excited to uh, be joining the Lynchburg community. We have been looking for a while in the Lynchburg area. It's, it's definitely an area of Virginia we've looked to expand into. It's uh, surprisingly a large community. A lot of people don't know that about Lynchburg. And as we look deeper and deeper into the community, we really fell in love with the town and the people in it. And so um, fortunately, this space fell into our lap and it was something we couldn't pass on. So we, we decided a couple months back to, to pursue this location and ever since uh, engaging with the Downtown Lynchburg Association and economic development team with the city, uh, it felt like a no-brainer and it, it felt so natural to become a part of the city. So Lynchburg's a great town and we're really excited about joining the community here in 2020. We're really excited to, to open up next year. Uh, as far as economic development purposes go, uh, the city's been a great partner so far. Um, obviously, the, the, the city is looking to, to continue to grow the already uh, great momentum they have downtown in the recent years. And so we're really excited to be a part of that economic development uh, growth opportunity. The revitalization of Main Street is something we're excited to be a part of. Obviously, there's a lot of construction going on, but uh, there should be uh, no problem with the end result. We're really excited about that. Uh, as far as jobs, we definitely are looking forward to hiring local. Uh, we're, we're working through what our staffing is going to be, but we we're, we're already have a job posting for a general manager of our space. They'll be in charge mostly of the front of the house operation here. And so that job posting's up, and we're excited to get some local Lynchburg folks applied for the job. And we'll have plenty of bartender shifts, and um, 
and full-time bartender jobs available. Uh, and of course, we'll, we'll likely have some brewing uh, interest as well. So, um, so lots of jobs, and uh, we're excited to be a part of the, the continued economic growth in this downtown historic area. With, with our expansion into Lynchburg, it's, uh, it's a great time to partner with the community here, and we're really, we're really, we feel strongly about giving back to the community that we join and, and really, really engaging with the customers and the community and the organizations that are already here in Lynchburg and so well established. And that's a big passion of ours and a mission for our company is to be, to really be a part of the fabric of the community. So we look forward to partnering with local charities and nonprofits and organizations that already do give a ton back to the city. Uh, we look forward to, to, to joining that group and and really, really helping Lynchburg continue its growth towards towards becoming, uh, you know, what it what it looks forward to in, in our 2040 plan, and and downtown in particular, really growing it to, to what, you know, everybody sees as a as a really big opportunity.